What's the biggest What's the biggest rap death for you? Juice World. As far as a rapper dying, that, that kind of hits you the most since yeah. you're so young, yeah. younger than us. Honestly, like, there hasn't really been too many rappers that, like, uh, affected me that heavy. But really? the person that I'll say that, that I cried from when died was Michael Jackson. I straight mm. up fucking cried when Michael Jackson died. I think everybody did. <laughs> I was like, I, I really fuck with Michael Jackson. I used to have um, his greatest hits. All of like, it was, it was like a that album, the the white album with the all of his greatest songs on it. Oh, yeah. That was like something I straight listened to for like. That was like one of the first albums I actually bought. So like, like from eight to like twelve, mm. I was fucking with Michael Jackson. Who's Rest your favorite peace. rapper now? Um, himself, or do you have himself, yeah, or yeah, have himself. Hmm. I'm trying to think of somebody I can say besides myself. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Are you, are, are you one of the guys that rides around listening to himself? I listen to. Actually, I do. I listen to myself. Mm. I do. I have to. If I don't listen to myself, you'll be able to tell, bro. My confidence would be off like a motherfucker, bro. I have to. A lot of people don't like listening. Yeah, I've heard that. They don't like uh, hearing their own voice. Right. I gotta be able to. I gotta listen to myself and then like, cause when I'm listening to my music, I'm envisioning, like, the next videos I'm picturing. I'm picturing myself performing. It's like I feel like you have to. In order to be a good artist, you have to listen to yourself. You gotta be able to fucking, so oh, I could have done better right here. And I feel like if you don't listen to yourself, you're afraid to like to criticize yourself. Well, it's interesting that you're pretty laid back mellow guy so like what's your stage presence like is it like you know rah rah bust rhymes <laughs> are, you pretty, are you like you know just laid back j cole style like what what is nah. what's your energy on stage on stage it's, it's i'm a whole different person to oh. be honest like, alter, so you're alter ego you alter, alter ego, ego. Oh, that's okay. when space boy kenny comes up got it got it, got it. <laughs> there's certain things that enhance it etc i'm sure you know maybe not mm. I'm not going to answer that. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I was just thinking simple, you know. <laughs> but, yeah. I'm not going to answer that one. No, 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 it's cool. So as far as your career, are you, look, are you looking to stay independent? Are you trying to get signed to a major label? Like, what's, what's your goal with that? As far as what I'm trying to go is, like, independent is definitely, like, a route that I want to take, but at the same time, it's like in order to get to a certain place, I need the help from major labels. Mm -hmm. But or I could do some Bad Bunny shit though. I could do some Bad Bunny he's shit. Not on a major? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny, he's a fucking. He is. He wrote like, his own yeah. ticket. No, nah, that nigga is crazy as fuck, bro. Okay, so Bad Bunny, like, before he fucking uh, was signed, he was like um, doing everything independent, and he signed with the. Uh, I can't remember the uh, the label's name. What's that nigga? Uh, Bad Bunny's label. No, 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 no. The first one that he signed to. Yeah, hear this. Is it hear this music? I ain't. It's it's something like that. This nigga about to look it up real quick. Mm -hmm. But yeah, bro, like he's he only like he doing ninety ninety ten. Damn. Honestly, that makes sense. Master P, he do own like he he owns a lot of corporations. Yeah, too. yeah, yeah. He yeah. own rap snacks and like. I think Cash Money had a deal like that too, where they got a lot of. A lot mm -hmm. of shit. Masterpiece crazy. That's another one too. That nigga, what he on rap snacks now? He on fucking, what's that noodles company that nigga has? He do got a noodles company. He got noodles, bread. A lot of <laughs> bread. That nigga is crazy, bro. What do you want to venture out besides uh, music, bro? I love clothes, bro. I love mm. clothes. I love fashion. Space Shout out, Space Boy. Can you do, yeah, do you have? Bro. You want to show the people? Oh, uh, this is this is something else right here. Oh, bro. okay, my bad. My this bad. is. I'm gonna show this off to you though, but. <laughs> I can't tell y'all the name because we're working on a new set of projects, but <laughs> just know, just know this shit crazy. Shout out to ETU. I'm a fucking, he be going crazy with this shit, but. So you're a, you like to design as well, correct? I like to design. I like to draw a little bit. I like, I want to, like, I like to do everything creative, bro. Like Are you left-handed? I, I am left-handed. Man. <laughs> <laughs> left-handed people are creative, man. We're 10% of the world. <laughs> Left-handed people are 10% of the world, man. Yo, he, you know all about the, yo, I'm writing on, 
the ink gets all on your on your pinky. You know, you know what this sounds like to me. The, oh, it the, sounds like you're you're a Pisces. Yeah, so yeah. it sounds like the, the zodiac stuff real. which which you hate. I, I do, but which you bring hand, up the left. Nine, oh, man, nine, left-handed people. Ten percent of people on the surf. I've left-handed. never heard of that in my life. Left-handed people are very creative. Look it up. What is it? So that means right-handed people aren't not as what creative. Does that mean? Like, usually, like the really the, really creative well, people. We use the right side of our brain. Yeah, we use the right side. Yeah, we're kind of facts. We usually are artists. Like, we're like nomads. Some like you'd be a nomad and roam the earth and say dollar just, just cause you're left handed. Yeah, that you sounds use, like the zodiac thing, which no, we it's not. both hate. Look it up, dude. Left handed people are ten percent, one out of ten. That's how special we are. It's not like a Pisces. That that I know. It's it's not a lot of left handed people. No, not at all. It's like I don't know. They used to. They don't like the left hands too. I guess like in what? I oh, what yeah. like society? I forgot. Yeah. It's like the. I don't know what it is. It's like UK or some shit. We got to edit it, but yeah, we'll edit it. They see it's like fine, a, fat, fact fine. They see um, the left hand is like dirty or something. Yeah. But. And you, you had to do everything right-handed. Like, oh, dude, I shit. Know I, I just realized it's fucking snowing on this bitch. Oh, you never saw snow, huh? <laughs> <laughs> snow is very foreign to you. You know, it's foreign. Hey, this I, is light. I, this thing hey, is real. I see snow like once a year, maybe. Yeah, but uh Yeah, shit's crazy. Sorry, I got distracted. No, nah, it's nice. cool, it's cool, it's cool. Um relaxation. What what do you what do you do? Tell the fans what you do for relaxation. <coughs> Chill. Uh oh shit. Yeah, no. that too. Oh, yeah, my, that my make pornos. Say no mas, say no mas. <laughs> say nah, no. um what the fuck do I do to relax? I feel like I feel like I shouldn't say what I do to relax. All right, all right. <laughs> let's, let's uh, go over let's this. Let's fucking fast forward. We'll that be on that uh, half baked shit. Oh, okay. Understood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so what's what's a day in the life like for you? Uh, wake up early as fuck. Go to the gym. Come back. Have a meeting. Go a out. Meeting? Yeah. <laughs> About. Uh, with my team, talk about analytics, what we need to post, what we need to get done for the day, uh, mm, what we need right. to do to get us to the next spot. Um, I like that. Go promo. Um, you, got, you definitely got him interested. You, you yes. Then. Sounds like a well thought out plan. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, hold on. He's like, hmm. Right, right, right. But yeah, pretty much that's everything. That's that's what I do all, like pretty much every day. Um, every day is promo. Uh, every day on the weekend, yeah. Mm. And yeah, honestly, not nah, every day is promo. Even if it's like, even if I'm not promoting like, like person to person, I'm still doing it on social media. So yeah. Which uh, social medias are you on? Everything. Yeah, everything. Space Boy Kenny. Space S P A C E Boy B O I, and then Kenny K E N N Y. You can find me on everything. I G. Yup. TikTok. Yup. Snapchat. Yup. Facebook? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I did. Uh, I mean, I, sure. I, you can I, find me on Facebook, probably. <laughs> your like your music vi- your music videos are very creative. Who uh, is that? All you or do you have a? That's that's the whole team. But the, but okay. the man behind the visuals is Etu. That man is crazy as fuck, man. Shout ETU. out to Etu. Yo, man, but he's sitting behind one of the cameras that's going on right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yo, he's, check out his videos. His videos are very. Uh, very creative. Crazy Very as creative. Fuck. Where is he from? Cali also? No, nah, this man from B More. He's straight oh. from <laughs> the Y. He was I in the wire. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is my motherfucking cousin. Oh, this oh, family. Yeah. Family. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, family ain't yeah, family. All right. All right. All right. Well, yeah, he cool. from he from Baltimore. Honestly, you know what's crazy? I was walking around. Everything. Every time I come to the East Coast, bro, all I smell is Old Bay, bro. And that shit's so crazy to me, bro. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> the, the season day, bro, I'm not even kidding. Old Bay. That so, shit got me addicted. The first time I went to Baltimore, bro, I was putting Old Bay on everything, bro. I shit you not. Right, it is an Old Bay thing. Yeah. Uh, Baltimore thing, Old Bay. Yeah, for sure. That, it smelled like that out here, too, though. That's what I'm saying. It does? Yeah, when I was walking down here, I was like, bro, I can smell Old Bay seasoning. But it's probably because, like, it was a crab shop, like, not too long, like, not too far from where I was. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's well, uh, I don't know, Zeke, you got anything? So if he's born and raised Baltimore? 
So y'all linked up in New Mexico. So what made you not want to punch a clock and follow his dream? <laughs> you believed in him that much. <laughs> How old are you? 26. 26, so he's a little older. That's... So you didn't want to punch a clock either? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that's that's the know, dream, that's man. Our, that's like our bit, like yo, motherfuckers that don't want to, like we we interview oh, a yeah. lot of people and everyone's like, punch a clock. Why would you, Why would you want to do that? Why would you want to conform to such foolery? You know what I'm yeah, saying? Like, we went to Exotica. That was yeah, yeah, yeah. They said yeah, they said dude, once you not punch a clock, you ain't going back. You ain't doing. Yeah. Honestly, I give it to y'all. I give it to y'all. Y'all motherfuckers that be punching in the clocks, bro. Y'all y'all tougher than me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real. I couldn't do that shit, bro. Like, that takes a lot, bro. Like, respect yeah. to y'all, for real. I feel like there's a little bit of slight, uh, <laughs> <laughs> a slight sarcasm there. Nah, but, I, I would never do it, but. Yeah, I, I would never shit, do it, but nah, <laughs> shout out to you. <laughs> you and that pension of yours. <laughs> people, gotta, people gotta take care of their families and shit. And it's like, it's by, by any means, bro. But, like, some niggas just like, I don't know. I'm one of those niggas that I'll find another way before I go fucking work a job. But like that's sometimes that's all you got, like for real, for real. Mm-hmm. And like some people make it work for them. But your your fondest memories of working is Wendy, so I mean <laughs> you don't wanna go. <laughs> 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 you you, you <laughs> love working at Wendy's. It was a good time, but you don't uh, wanna go back. You don't I wanna say I love working at Wendy's. Uh, Honestly. Did your mom, did your mom put your clock? My mom, um, she was a stay-at-home mom, but before oh, that, man. she used to, she did a lot of shit. My, my mom did a lot of shit. She was a soldier. She used to be a nurse. Oh, damn. Um, right. So, yeah, you already know how that was. Um, she used to, she went to beauty school, too. She used to do hair and shit like that. She's crazy. Honestly, I, I don't even, like, I don't even know everything my mom did before I was born type shit. I could just, I, I could tell y'all what she did while I was alive. That's it. <laughs> do you have a... was a different person. I mean, siblings do Before that. I was here. Oh, my bad. Oh, no, you're chilling. I got motherfucking, it's eight of us in total, but I got seven siblings. I'm the eighth child. Damn. Crazy. There's fucking four girls, and then there's four boys. Mm. And I'm middle child out of all of them. <laughs> oh, wow. So you mentioned your team. Did your team have a name? How many have a vision? Just a motherfucking, we the Grays. Um, we got ETU. We got motherfucking OG String Cheese. We got the the archive. We got um. Y'all sound, y'all sound like Odd Future. <laughs> <laughs> a, little similar. a little similar to Odd Future. I, I guess you could say that the comparison is cool. I fuck with Odd Future, but nah, yeah, yeah. We got a whole little team going on. Um, it's a lot. It's a lot of other people too. Um, shout out to the OGs. Mm-hmm. Um, am I forgetting anybody? Shit. Oh yeah, 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 Nasita. Shout out to Nasita, the producer. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the pro- in-house producer. Yeah, yeah, oh, two, two of them. Uh, the archive. He's a, he's one of the producers, and then John Nasita's one of the producers. What, what equipment are they using? Do you know? Um, as far as fucking Nasita, he, my homie Nasita, he be building his own shit. His man got his own uh, speakers built up. But as far as the the DAW that they use, um, both use FL. FL. Yep. Yeah. FL has came a long way. He's the producer guy. He's, oh, you be producing? Uh, yeah. Right? You, <laughs> you don't you know produce my, no more? I, I got kids. Right? Yeah, he, uh, my spare time, uh, you know, I, I used to dibble like. and dabble. You want to play the modest, humble road. <laughs> but, <laughs> you, still, you, you still be fucking with shit every now and then. You have to send me something, bro. Uh, uh, I'll, I'll send you some, some of my older work. Hollywood, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Hollywood, like I'm all, I ain't going to send you shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe shit. Hey, I, I, hey, I man, just want to clarify. It's old work. This yeah, is from, man, it's from I, years I got, ago. He hit you with the, I got you, Joe. I got you. Hit me on my, <laughs> hit me on my line. Voice, voice got with rays and shit. Hit me on my line. <laughs> I guess you got my number. Right, right, right. One of those. That's what he did. That's what he did, Richie. Definitely. Um, yo, tell the people about you. Tell people where, where to find you. Where you headed next? Um... As far as like out here, or like it, like no next city. Oh, uh, the next city, shit, nigga. Um, <laughs> I don't fucking know. 
Uh, we might go to wake up and go. Yeah, wake up. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Like we that, might though. go to some left-handed yeah, yeah. shit. Just, just wake up and just play. All right, where am I? <laughs> some left-handed shit. Don't even pack a suitcase, nigga. Just hop on that motherfucking Bring plane. A here. Nah, nigga. I just Dang. hop on the plane. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm <laughs> oh, <laughs> man, that's living right there. Right. Right. Soon though, I'll, I'll soon I'll though, shit. Yeah, I'll get that's how I wanna live, there. bro. Dang. Soon Dang. though, I hate suitcases. <laughs> I fucking hate suitcases. But um. The next trips are Atlanta and Miami. Okay. So, okay. Yeah, anybody uh, see this? Y'all in there? You on those fucking those stage? Tap in with us. Well, for sure. Tap in. Uh, like I said, tell people your new project was coming out. Yeah, 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 yeah. My new project, Kingdom Hearts. Make sure y'all look that shit up on motherfucking YouTube. Um, Creative. Yep, yep, yep. Um, before that, I just dropped a song, Coffee and Two. Honestly, you can find everything on my YouTube. Make sure you type that shit in. Space Boy Kenny. Space, S-P-A-C-E, Boy, B-O-I, and then Kenny, K-E-N-N-Y. Yeah. Appreciate you uh, coming out, man. I know it's the first time you're seeing bro. flurries out here. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm just hoping this shit stick. But. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, yeah, sports Life and Hip Hop, we, we uh, man, it still is flurries. But we love to. Yeah, Those are some big ass fucking. Man, just that hawk hit you. I know you was like, "Fuck!" You send me back west. <laughs> that hawk, that hawk hit you all up in here. All right, this is this is what it really was. Once we fucking hopped on the motherfucking uh, the fucking train after we got off the fucking plane, I felt somebody open that door, and I was like, "Damn, bro, that's what the breeze feel like out here." <laughs> I was like, "That's different." Instantly, I was like, "No, nah, I need my jacket, bro." I was like, "I ain't bullshitting." You felt the, the vortex. Yeah, yeah, this, this what is, you this mean, is vortex, like, bro? <laughs> what you mean? You don't even know what the vortex is. <laughs> oh, these niggas got different shit out here, bro. Fighting demons and shit. Yeah, D- you Dan- ain't even dangerously run past the vortex cold. yet. <laughs> yeah, stay, like, stay bro, in Vegas, man. I'm trying to go man. anything called the vortex. The vortex is a bitch. You be like, what? January in Chicago? <laughs> but no, nah, we appreciate you coming on, coming out here, man. Uh, Getting your music out is dope. Uh, it, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate E Absolutely. and behind the scenes. ETU. ETU. Sorry, I keep calling him E. It's real easy for me. <laughs> ETU. But uh, thanks again, man. Appreciate it. Love, love, man. Space Boy Kenny. Space Boy sports Kenny. Life and sports Life and Hip Hop, y'all. Shout yeah, I just realized, too, we ain't talking nothing about motherfucking sports, bro. <laughs> well, this is the life in hip hop. <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's cool, though. I don't know shit about sports, so I'm glad y'all didn't ask me nothing about sports. That would have been bad, nigga. Nah, y'all would have like, which number is LeBron James? I would have like 17. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's cool. It ain't, it ain't about sports with us all the time. We talk about a wide range of things. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but yeah, uh, Multifaceted. <laughs> yeah, I know you're like, man, this nigga asked about anime? Whoa, you know. So, but, uh, yeah, thanks for coming out. And a shout-out to Billionaire Mike behind the scenes. Billionaire Mike. Uh, shout-out to Joe, Channel shout- 7. Zeke and I, we, you, will never, you never know where you'll see us next or interview next. We don't know. So. Oh, shit. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my OnlyFans and my Christian Mingles account. <laughs> um... <laughs> Yeah. Space Space Boy Kenny, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. Right. You just like Christian Mingle and OnlyFans. But, butt naked sex. Like, I don't know else to say. Can't, can't segue into that one. It's peace, peace. Sports life and hip hop. Sports life and hip hop, yo. Yeah. <laughs>